G'day, so I'm just going to run you through how to build um, a board so that you can um, boot off an SD card uh, to do the pairing issue fix. Um, basically what I have, I have eight wires, most of them the same colour. I've got a red and a blue which I'm going to use as my positive and negative. Um, I've got a 14 pin cable. Uh, the pitch on these is 0.5. Um, I've got a um, 14 pin cable to you know, solder pad. Um, once again, 14 pin, 0.5 millimeter, and then I've got a SD board, um, and it's got all the different um, connections written on there for both uh, SPI and uh, SDIO. So, what I've done with my cables, I've just twisted the ends and tinned them all so they fit through nicely. I know I haven't got any um, loose strands; they're going to short out on something next to it. Um, the reason why I did the red and blue was, you know, I'm going to use them for positive and negative. I want them to be easy to identify. That way, you know, I make sure that there's no mistakes. A lot of these boards will come with, like, header pins. Um, you can use those if you want. Then you can just plug cables into them. Um, I find sometimes you don't get the best connection with them, um, especially if your connectors aren't quite right um, and if you're going to solder something to the board well you might as well just do wires and that way you know you're getting a really good connection anyway I've also got a bit of, also got a bit of flux um, which I love to use a bit of solder and I've got a soldering iron ready to go uh, I also have a list of where all the different pins go so I'll be referring to that along the way um, just to make sure there's no mistakes anyway so I'm going to start on the uh, on the 14 pin board end um, and I'll attach a wire here and then I'll attach the other end of that wire to the actual SD card so I'm doing one wire and one hit um, that way you know I'm not getting getting them mixed up later on anyway so I'm going to start at number one which is data one so I'll just pop him through the hole there's me solder I'm trying to, and what you'll notice is when you turn the board over, it's actually backwards. So one is 14, see that? One on this side where it's going through is 14 on the other side because it would actually be reverse if you were working on the other side of the board. Anyhow, I'm standing on my um, soldering iron cable, which never helps. I didn't do any flux, but this is uh, flux core solder, so it should be fine anyway. Righto. So I've sold them in that end. So pin one. Then I cut off whatever's left because I don't want too much hanging on. So pin one goes to data one. So if I grab this board, that's data one there. So I'll pop him through there. If you notice what I'm doing, I've just got my roller solder there. I've hung a bit of solder out and this way I can work you know with two hands um, quite easily it's not the best soldering job I've done but yeah I'm gonna put a little bit of flux on it I'm not very happy with that one just didn't really float my boat so I'll just work a bit of flux all the way down the side there get a bit of flux on him and I'll just reheat that because I'm not happy with it that's better Yeah, still looks a bit rubbish, but we'll be right. Righto. Got one in, seven to go. Let's just bang a bit of flux on here as well. Righto. So the second pin is pin three. Grab me another brown one. Whoop. Jam in the hole. And 
somehow I've also magically managed to solder pins in, but we'll be right. And data two goes through pin ten. So who's that guy? Number three is data zero. So where's data zero? Data zero is that guy. One is six, which is our clock. Yes, make sure that's six and not nine. Six, as I said, goes to clock. Uh, where's the clock? Clock, clock, clock. There it is. Clock. Give me a bit more solder off the roll. Seven is next. Number seven. There's me solder gone. What I'm meant to be doing, I'm not doing it very well. So you're meant to uh, heat up uh, the material you want to melt the solder to, not heat up the solder. Once the material, so the pad and the wire coming through it, gets to hot enough temperature, and the solder will just melt into it. Anyway, so that was number seven. Yep, number seven, which is CMD. See there, that's CMD, so let's get that guy in there. So let's do it properly this time, eh? Let's heat up the pad and the solder and the wire and then introduce a bit of solder to it. And as you notice, I get a really nice little um, domed finish to it, which is good. That's what you want to see. This one here is a little, yeah. There's probably just a little bit too much solder on that. Doesn't matter, it'll be right. So halfway. So that was number seven. Next is number eight, which is our ground, which I'm doing is blue. Number eight. Which on this side is number seven. It's pretty funny. Okay, so let's heat up the pad and the wire and introduce a bit of solder. As you can see, that looks much better. Just has a much nicer finish when you look at it. Number eight is ground, which is here. Right, I have to finish this because it's killing my back. So let's heat up the pad and the pin for a second and then introduce some solder. Okay, number nine is 
data three. <sighs> So grab a brown wire. Number nine. Once again, let's just heat up that pad and the wire a bit and then introduce some solder. The wires will get a little bit hot on you, but yeah, you'll get used to it. So that's number nine, which is data three at this end. The sun seems to have gone down for some reason. Data three in the middle there. Assume you can still see the picture. Right, I heat up the pin and the wire. A little bit of solder in there. Yeah, good to go. Let's cut that guy off. Right, uh, what did we say that was? Number nine. Number ten is data two. Am I wire short? <laughs> I might be wire short. It's looking that way. Hmm. Okay. Uh, number 10 is <coughs> data 2. Oh no, I'm not going to be a wire short. All oh, good. I'm used to counting the other way. So let's heat it up a bit and heat it up with a bit of solder. we say number 10 so data 2 I like having a nice long length on the wires that I'm using that I've tinned because it means that when I stick it through the board I get really good penetration you can see how that comes through like that and I know that there's not going to be any issues I know it's coming right through the board and when I solder it it's gonna be there and then I just use my little snips to just um, Cut off the excess I don't want. Right, oh no, I'm not a I'm not a wire short. There's one more to go. That's a positive. Uh, so he is pin 12. Just plugs in here. I touched the solder and got some solder on my soldering iron, but it doesn't matter, we'll do it the other way this time. There you go. There's no right or wrong way. Not my book anyway. So as long as you get a nice clean join. And 3 volt line is up here. It says 3 volt, but it's actually 3.3. .3. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to this guy up and then add a bit of solder oh that's getting hot oh. looks like it needs just a touch more in there right oh that's it that's our board so let's just clear all this out of the way we don't need that soldering on anymore, we don't need the solder, we don't need the flux, we don't need the side cutters, we can get rid of all of that. So that's that's ready to go. The only thing you need to do is just get rid of all this gunk kicking around. 
a couple of things I normally do. Cleaner. You know, I'm a big fan of cleaning, especially when I've been using flux. So I'm just going to hit the back of the board, give it a bit of a scrub. You be careful when using the old cotton tip, you'll get cotton everywhere, especially with all these pins. A bit jagged as well. I'm just trying to clean all that dirty flux off. Right, so that's good to go. The only thing we need to do is to put our cable in. So as you can see the pins on this one are on the bottom of the connector so we need to slide this in so you just lift this guy here the black guy slide it in you want to make sure it's nice and square and then you just lock it down and do the exact same thing on the drone. <laughs> 